Good evening, everybody. Uh, my name is Paul Felder. I'd like to invite you to this year's World AIDS Day Vigil uh, in the heart of Manchester's Gay Village in Sackville Park on a very wet and uh, cold December evening. The theme for this year's World AIDS Day is universal access and human rights. And I'm extremely pleased as our first speaker, we've got the Lord Mayor of Manchester, Councillor Alison Firth, who brings a message of support to the vigil tonight. Lord Mayor. Well, thank you everybody for your very warm welcome and for braving the rain, but we're very strong here in Manchester. World AIDS Day on the 1st of December is our opportunity to focus on the sobering statistics around HIV and AIDS and to remember all those people who have died. Since 1981, more than 25 million people have died of the disease and the latest figures suggest that around 33 million people are currently living with HIV worldwide. Around 67% of these people live in sub-Saharan Africa where access to appropriate medical assistance is often very hard and more important, often impossible to access. Millions on that continent are in urgent need of life-saving drugs which would save their lives and there are over 10 million children in Africa left without parents because of the epidemic. Hence, it's particularly appropriate that this year's World AIDS Day theme, as Councillor Fairweather has mentioned, is universal access and human rights. Another sobering fact is that people under 25 years of age account for around half of new HIV infections globally and the majority of these people will die from AIDS before they are 35. It is with this knowledge that we come together in Manchester to commemorate World AIDS Day, almost 30 years since HIV first began to affect Manchester residents. We gather to remember those people we have known and lost to the virus. We gather also to remember those lives lost to the epidemic worldwide. Numbers of new infections, both locally and regionally, are still rising. If it is particularly important that we continue to focus on HIV awareness, education and safer sex, not only today, but all the year round. Thank you very much for coming this evening.